And we are pleased to be joined by our first New Brunswick selection in this year's draft for us, Preston Lansbury. Preston, how are you feeling today? I'm uh, feeling great. Dream come true right now and uh, still feeling uh, the draft and being chosen by you guys, the Moncton Wildcats, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, like you said, I mean, you're just down the road, grew up in uh, in Salisbury, played your whole uh, hockey career so far in, in uh, Greater Moncton, I guess. So what does it mean for you to be drafted by your hometown team? Oh, I mean, it's going to be cool representing a place where there's not very many people that get the opportunity that I have. So I really want to cherish that and um, make the hometown nice and proud. And yeah, it's, it's going to take a lot to make the hometown team, but I think I'll be able to do it and help the team win. So. And you had quite the season this year playing with the Moncton Flyers. Obviously, you guys won the championship. Uh, just talk about the season you had, the development you had, and um, you know, overall what the, how the season was for you. Yeah, it started off a little slow. We had a young team this year, so it took us a little bit longer than we wanted to to adapt to the league. But once we uh, got clicking and the boys started to get rolling, uh, we actually had a really good team, and we started to win a lot of games and we got the chance to actually play in the finals and win the championship, which uh, meant a lot to all of us, and it was a pretty cool experience. Yeah, I remember seeing some of the clips. That was that was quite a night. And you had mentioned before, yeah. too, a few of your teammates this year actually were called up to uh, to our team at the end of the season with the, the list of injuries we had. So a few other of, uh, of your former teammates had a chance to play with us. Did they talk about that experience at all? Uh, yeah, I got a chance to play with Tristan on the line with him and uh, he talked about it quite a bit and seemed like he was having lots of fun with you guys and uh, just made me want to make it even more and hopefully get drafted by you guys and I get the chance and it's a surreal at the moment so and then Joe Jim on the defensive side got a chance to play later in the year so we were all happy for him and he was pretty pumped to be able to be a part of it too. Yeah, it's a great group you guys had there this year. So we're fortunate to have you uh, as part of our team. And I know you also have a bit of a connection with one of our coaches, uh, Josh Heptid. You had worked with him a few years back. Um, so talk a little bit about the relationship you have with him and what that's like coming into this, you know, knowing a little bit of the, the coaching side already. Yeah, I mean, we only had him for a little bit of time, but it would have been nice to have him a little longer. He was a great, great coach and everybody loved him. He was a nice guy. He seemed like he knew a lot about the game and he was willing to help everybody, even if it was forwards and defense. And I think he would have helped us a lot if we had the chance to go to provincials, but just because of COVID, COVID, our season got cut short, but he definitely mm -hmm. helped us in the short period of time he got a chance to be with us. That's awesome. And what are you uh, looking to bring to training camp this year? What are you looking to kind of put on display for the, the staff when you show up here in August? I definitely want to play, stick to my game and show why I want to be there and be myself and and they pick me and I think that I can be a good player for them and they, there's a reason they pick me and I need to show it and if I play my game then I think I'll have a good shot. That's awesome. Like I said, you're our first first New Brunswicker of the day, so we're extremely happy to have you. I'm sure your family's uh, pretty excited that you'll be nice and close to home, that's for sure. <laughs> Yeah, for sure. <laughs> well, thanks so much for taking the time, Preston. Uh, we will see you. Not that you have a far drive to go in August, but <laughs> we'll see you in August uh, at the Avenir Center. All right. Sounds good. Thank you. Thank you.